All right. Well, that was annoying. Let's go down in here. We have a farmer to assist. Oh, oh, thank goodness. Listen, lad, could you do me a favor? Yeah, sure. I've got to, you know, answer a call of nature. Oh, stay here and watch this stock for me. There's a good lad. Uh, okay. Just stand between those two stacks and don't move. I will I'll do put that. A word in for you when I get back. Oh, that's a good deed. Right. That equals money. Won't be long. I like money. Money's good. My cousin says that the barrels in these warehouses might have stuff in them. That's nice. I don't care. Quick. While he's away, smash his barrels up and see what's inside. No, I'm doing unless this for gold. Unless you're too scared. Unless you're just a big blubbing girl. The hell did you call me? Come on, let's go and break stuff. That was insulting. I'm going to there, like a lemon. beat your ass. You need to stop. But being good is so boring. No, it's not. It gets you money. Wouldn't you prefer to be smashing things? No. Leave me alone. Come Don't... on. There's still time before he gets back. As long as he doesn't call me a lemon, I'm fine. Oh, you're no fun at all. Well, are you done? Fine. Have your stupid good deed, then. He didn't call me a lemon. Did he call me a lemon and I missed it? Oh, well, one for the Gipper. What's that for? It's for being annoying. I hate you. Excellent. Thanks, lad. You've done me a big favor. I'll let your dad know what a splendid watchman you made. That's probably one of the first thing he said was lemon thing. I thought I was going to time that really well. I was going to be like, oh, look, he just call me a lemon. And I was going to punch him in the face saying he called me a lemon. But I missed the joke. I missed the joke. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Look, there's a little swine. I'm no! After him. Leave me alone. Eh? You're welcome. Come on, Rosie. Let's change your stuffing. Yay, that's four. So I think that's enough. I'm not sure how many gold pieces it is. Hang on, let's talk to the trader and figure out how it's many gold pieces it is. Yep. Hello, lad. I'm a trader. Yep. Some little girl, I see. Yep. And it seems you haven't. It just yep. so happens that I have a wave a nice box. Drop the price on me. To put a I don't need. I face. okay. Three. Thank you. That's all I needed to know. I'm a fool. Just fool. Remember. What? Oh, wait. You again? Ah, oh, God. See, your banter got me in trouble again. It's I'm all your hearing fault. of your mischief rather regularly. Shall we remind ourselves? No. Violent conduct towards a person or persons without God's permission. I didn't have your permission to beat up the bully, but you let me do it anyway. Accessory to improper man and lady behavior. We've already been over that. Do you realize the trouble you'd be in if you weren't such a little un? Uh, no, because you wouldn't see me do it. Now go and keep yourself out of trouble. Oh, that was quite the tongue lashing, sir. I will make sure not to do any more bad things ever unless they get me things that I need for progressing through the game. Hi. Hi, Dad. Mm. I'm a man of my word, so here's the gold for your good deeds. Are you mad because I tattled on the prostitute? Are you serious? But if you think that I'll turn a blind eye to your mischief, you're very wrong. I didn't do anything! Look, try to keep out of trouble, please, for me. The guards are corrupt. Well, I think you may have enough there, son. Have you spoken to the trader? Yes, I have. I can do math, thank you. Five gold pieces. I think five is actually the maximum you can get. Um, you can bust open the boxes for a gold piece. Uh, and I think that's the only one I missed out on. Ooh, you're lucky I've still got these sweets. Quickly, give me three. It's kind of Young stupid sir. to do min-maxing with, like, the early part of the game, but I, f I like to feel the that I've got the most out of every part of... Uh, of the level or whatever even if it's like the tiniest things like getting gold pieces in this really early tutorial section i don't know in the long run it really doesn't matter because we're gonna get crazy amounts of money later but hey there's our sister hello little brother i hope you haven't forgotten what day it is 
Like you did last night. You actually look way better. I'm sorry if I woke you up last night. It was another of those dreams. I was standing in this field when something happened. But I can't remember what. Never mind that, though. I'm still waiting for my present. Oh, aren't you a greedy little shit? Wait a minute, you had a dream about having... You were standing in a field? But, but you were standing in a field right now! What does that mean? D did you freeze and everything else keep moving? Yeah, 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 you did. That, that's what just happened. Mm-hmm. She's gone stone cold as a statue. And the only cure seems to be chocolate for this ailment. Um, well, this is a predicament. Do I want to launch the events of this game? Yes. I knew you were going to bring me chocolates. It's just like my dream. Well, that takes the Come fun out of it. Let's go home. Mother will be back for my party any minute now. All right. Let's find nothing interesting. I'm pretty sure there's something in that later. Is there anything else I can do back here that's special or unique or interesting? Or is this it? Okay. Well, here we go. Wait, there's something wrong. Bandits! <laughs> oh, hey, they fixed the lag What's in that really cutscene. Awesome. They're here. You've got to hide. I might have spoken too soon, we'll see. Got one! Evil had come to Oakvale. Bandits wielding torches and steel, slaying and burning all in their path. Blood red flames lit the night as the villagers screamed and begged for mercy, and soon their bodies filled the streets. Then the raiders reached the last house, where the boy and his family lived. It was then they had slaughtered so many to find. The father fought to protect his kin, but he was no warrior, who fell mortally wounded. The bandits ripped the house apart, but could not find the boy. Through torture and threats, his mother and sister remained silent, and their furious attackers took them both. From the nearby woods, the boy watched as all he knew was taken away. His whole life was crushed to ashes. He was alone. All over a box of chocolates. Good job, Teresa. Well, there appears to be death and destruction everywhere. Um, and uh, thankfully, that small bush provided us enough cover to not die in the slaughter. So now, we're going to head through this town, burning and hellish as it is and um see if we can discover some survivors wow that's some conveniently placed boxes there that seem to have fallen directly out of the sky to block our path also i wouldn't advise running over a burning bridge that's obviously made out of wood that that okay i'm i'm, I'm picking apart fable aren't i never mind just never mind I am very happy that they fixed the cutscenes. They were laggy as balls when this game first came out. It was really horrendous. We must leave. It's not safe here. Oh my god. They're all dead. You don't want to join them, do you? Then give me your hand. He looks kind of like Andros. Uh, his reskin's a little strange. Not sure why they made him look like Andros, but. Hmm. I thought you'd have a stronger stomach than that. It came out of the back of his neck. Oh my Save God. your energy, boy. It's not me you want to fight. You might not realize it, but I just saved your life. There's nothing left for you in Oakvale. And if you'd stayed, you'd be as dead as the rest of them. Come with me 